Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. Today is absolutely freezing cold outside. So I thought what better way and day to do this video on. I think it's quite hard in winter to feel chic, feel put together. Um, oftentimes we just want to wrap up hats, gloves, scarves, huge puffer coats, things like that. So I wanted to break down five really easy ways and methods that you can stay classy and chic in the winter. So tip number one is, if in doubt, go for the three color rule. So that means essentially picking a color palette of three and keeping your outfit within those tones. I think it's nice to have three colors because you get some dimension in the outfit, but not too much going on where the eye doesn't know where to look. It still feels very cohesive, but like I say, you get a bit of contrast and dimension. So for example, I've gone for this cream sweater with a camel coat and then a kind of camely belt to tie that in, some gray trousers and then trainers to tie in with the lighter cream um, knit and hat. So I always think gray, cream and camel always look so good together. Camel and gray I think work particularly nicely together. So think about some different tones that you could use. What's nice about these colors is that the camel is used to lighten up the gray, which it can be a little bit flat and dull, but the camel just sort of brings it alive. So think about different color combinations that you can use within your wardrobe, but try and keep it to three. It keeps it classy and it keeps it feeling cohesive. Tip number two is to always finish with a smarter coat if you're wearing a casual outfit. So for example, I've gone for this tracksuit. I mean, it doesn't have to be a tracksuit look any sort of casual look. I'm wearing a lot of knitted trousers at the moment, which are so comfortable and warm, um, but obviously tracksuit is something a lot of us wear around the house. It's something day to day that keeps us warm and cozy, but it can feel a little bit too relaxed. And that's why I like to add a smarter coat. Again, just to kind of keep it feeling quite classy. I would say that is something that really defines my style is that I do like to keep things feeling relatively polished and classic and classy. And I think a smart coat or a blazer, maybe if it's slightly warmer for your winter, a blazer or a coat really finishes the look off. You've still got that warm outer layer, but instead of more of a casual puffer coat, it just adds a bit of contrast against those casual pieces. So tip number three is head to toe lighter colors. And I think you'll notice that pretty much all of these are not necessarily items you have to go and buy, but tips that you can apply within your wardrobe. Buy lighter colors, here I've gone for um, these wide leg trousers. Um, these are a white with these creamy tones um, with the coat and the knit and then white trainers. You don't have to go um, for all of these creamy tones together or the white tones. This could be your rendition of lighter colors. So it could be a beige color palette. It could be a very pale gray, but I think those lighter tones definitely have a classy feel. And when you do them head to toe together, they instantly give you a lift. A lot of us may put our cream jumpers with some black or gray trousers, but actually how can you pull out your white jeans from summer and pair that with your cream knit? It doesn't have to be head to toe. Um, you could put some black boots and a black coat on with this to kind of tie it all together. But I think that all lighter look or gravitating towards mostly lighter tonal shades instantly feels really classy. My tip number four is to add a shirt. Now I feel like this does a lot to the look. A shirt definitely is one of those classy timeless pieces that adds some structure to the outfit. So I think that's why a shirt um, has that kind of more traditional classic tone. Um, because of its structured nature. It's not like a slobbish piece of clothing. It's, we associate shirts with more formal dressing. So it's nice to add that into your winter wardrobe. Obviously shirts can be a little bit cool, particularly in the winter if you're not layering. So that's why I think it's so nice to layer a shirt under a roll neck like the one I'm wearing here. This one is from Theory. It's the same one I've got on here. Um, but it's just a really simple way to add that kind of structured look to your 
outfit, but also to add some contrast, um, some creativity as well, some playfulness, some layers into your outfit. This one would be a really nice look for the office. I've gone for the skirt from my Naked Fashion collection, just paired with this knit and then the shirt. Again, thinking about tones and colors, you don't want to go too over the top with this, try and keep it quite minimal. I've kept quite a few pieces black to tone in together um, and I've gone for this brown belt to tone in with the brown shirt. Obviously it doesn't have to be these colors, but I think as a rule, try and keep it relatively tonal um, and minimal colors, I think, because we've already got quite a lot going on with the shirt layering. You don't need to add even more to the mix with mixing colors. And that's when I think a look can become a little bit less classy looking. So finally number five, um, and I just thought this was quite a fun one to add in, is to add a headband. I think it's just such a preppy accessory. Again, it doesn't have to cost lots. You may already own a collection of headbands, I know I do. Um, but I just think they instantly look chic. You can keep all your layers and your cozy pieces on, um, but it just gives a lift to your outfit again, whilst not taking away from any of that warmth. So I've got one in here from Amazon. I'll try and link it below really affordable piece, but I just think it lifts the outfit so much. And you can wear them in the daytime. They don't have to be reserved for evening. I think they look so nice in the day. Dress down a little bit more with some jeans, a knit, coat like I've got on here. And also I've gone for some loafers. This sort of fits in with the preppy look of the headband. Um, so let's, let's go with the term preppy accessories. I think it's always a nice one to include within your winter look. Um, to keep it feeling a little bit more classic, chic, um, pulled together as well. So those preppy accessories, things like headbands, maybe a bow in the hair, a pair of loafers, I think all kind of add to make quite a pulled together kind of look. So I hope that's been useful. Just five really easy tips that you can apply to your wardrobe. Now, if you're looking for some winter inspo and a bit of a refresh, hopefully this will help. Do let me know below. Um, give me any suggestions of what you'd like to see. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.